First, Gwen Stefani scored her first number one song in country music with her duet with boyfriend Blake Shelton, Nobody But You, and now she's officially made her Opry debut. On Saturday, May 9th, the pop singer who's now dipped her toes in the country genre sang the couple's hit duet song alongside her love, and you better believe that Shelton was not only proud, but as an Opry member, let Stefani know how honored he was to have her on the show. However, due to the coronavirus and where the couple has been quarantining together, the Opry looked a tad bit different for them. I'm Addison Hager with Taste of Country, and we always love bringing you the latest country music news. So if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you're always the first to know of country music breaking news. Rather than performing in the Opry in Nashville, the couple brought the Opry to them with a makeshift background on Blake's farm in Oklahoma, while Dustin Lynch and Trace Adkins performed on stage at the Grand Old Opry house. Before jumping into their song, Stefani was clearly soaking up such a surreal moment, while Shelton took that time to say how proud he was of the singer. Very honored to have you on the show, and even though we're doing the, uh, you know, the Oklahoma Old Red Grand Ole Opry appearance uh, because of everything that's going on, as soon as this is all over with, uh, we've got to get you at the, to the uh, Opry House in Nashville and, and do this that way also. Shelton made his own Opry debut back on May 5th, 2001, performing his debut single, Austin, and was inducted into the institution as a full member on October 23rd, 2010. I don't want to live without you. I don't want to even breathe. The Grand Old Opry has suspended all of its weekday live shows through May 16th due to the coronavirus, but the Saturday night shows are continuing without live audiences, with limited techs and musicians, and everyone is practicing social distancing. Keith Urban, Kelsey Ballerini, and Morgan Evans will take the Opry stage on Saturday, May 16th. Then on May 23rd, the Grand Old Opry has a sweet tribute for Memorial Day weekend. It will focus on a salute to the troops, honoring United States military and essential workers on the front line of the COVID-19 fight. Craig Morgan, Stephen Curtis Chapman, and Kelly Pickler will be performing as we say thank you to those who need it most right now. I'm Addison Hager with Taste of Country. Thanks for watching, and as always, thanks for subscribing.